put the Wisconsin running back's greatness into perspective, consider this. He had 32 rushing touchdowns this year. That is more than 105 teams have in college football. And on top of that, he caught six touchdown passes and threw one, a season worth reliving. Defenders, avert your eyes. his fourth touchdown of the night. Throws it back to Russell Wilson. That touchdown, Wisconsin. The halfback with the throwback to the quarterback for six. And here's Ball breaking to daylight. Monty Ball, touchdown, Badgers. It's complete, and it's going to be a Wisconsin touchdown to Monty Ball. Wilson, shovel pass. He's in. Monty Ball, second behind only Barry Sanders in terms of both single season rushing touchdowns and overall touchdowns. The first player in NCAA history to score at least two TDs in every game of a 13 game season. Monty Ball joins us now from our studio in Madison. And first of all, Monty, I was reading the Chicago Tribune when you won the Silver Football Award. Congratulations on that, by the way. And in Teddy Greenstein's piece, it said that your name is actually pronounced Monte, have we been saying it wrong all along? Uh, yeah, everyone's been been calling me by, you know, call me Monty or Armani ever since around like first grade because I never would put the accent over the second E, so I kind of did it to myself. Do you want us to change? Because we could. <laughs> no, no, it's too late now. You know, just keep calling me Monty <laughs> or Monty. <laughs> all right, we'll go with Monty then. Fourth in the Heisman balloting last week. What was the highlight of the weekend? Honestly, I think the highlight of the weekend was, um, you know, right before we left this little area that they kept all of his finals in, finalists in, um, Trent Richardson had a little, you know, inspirational speech that he gave to us and basically said that, uh, you know, he wouldn't have chosen any, any other players in the nation to experience this with. So, you know, it really hit home for me man, a lot and really just getting the chance just to meet the guys was something I was looking forward to. They're really down to earth and really pretty a bunch of cool guys. It seemed like a great group. It seemed like you guys had a good time together and represented yeah. college football well. 38 touchdowns on the year and counting. Which one has been the most memorable? Uh, the most memorable touchdown is, is still the, uh, the, the Nebraska run that I had about four yards outside the end zone. And just I was extremely pumped. Heading back to the Rose Bowl, you guys fell just a little bit short last year. Have you had a chance to watch Oregon on tape at this point? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I watched them a little bit and, um, you know, they're exactly what what we expect, they're fast uh, athletes and uh, really do a great job rallying to the football and making plays. So we just got to make sure that we capitalize this time on, a, on an opportunity, this time in the Rose Bowl, and uh, just make sure that we go in there focused. Yeah, what has been the talk amongst the guys as you prepare to head out there in light of what happened last season? Uh, focus. Stay focused the entire time. Approach is like it's a business trip. And uh, just you know, while we're having fun in, in Pasadena and L.A., make sure that we know why we're there. Omani well, Ball, Monte Ball. Congratulations on all your accomplishments, and thanks again for spending some time with us. No problem, man. Thank you. Thanks for having me.